What's up, you guys? It's Mika here. Meekity Meek 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 from Cosmic Warrior. All right, this reading here is going to be for my Capricorns. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. All right, so this is going to be a general love spread, Capricorns. Um, I do appreciate the likes. Um, please like it up. I really appreciate it. It helps my videos circulate. It helps it grow throughout YouTube. Help me help you, baby. All right. So I'm going to get right into it here. Um, keep in mind that you can exchange energy, um, Capricorns. And um, if it don't fit, then it don't fit. Take what resonates and please leave the rest. All right. Let's see what the overall energy is here for my Capricorns. Yes, Capricorns, I do offer personal reads as well. Okay, so if the story resonates and you want more advice or you want to go deeper and you want more details um, or coaching, um, yes, just hit me in my inbox. I'll put that in the description below um, to schedule a reading. And yes, and follow me on TikTok for different content. All right. All right, so... All right, so you could be dealing with a Sagittarius here, okay? Um, right now, what I see here, Capricorns, is that, like, you may be feeling like you're stuck in a connection here. You're stuck in some type of connection here where somebody is just not ready for you, okay? They're just not ready, all right? Or either they don't see your worth here. Or they're just not ready for true love. That's what I see. And it's some problems um, revolving around this here. It's problems revolving around this person like not being ready here. And then it's like, um, yeah, it's it's like you're stuck. It's like you feel like, you know, like where, where do you go? It's like where do you go from here basically with this person possibly? Okay, that could that could be possibly how you're feeling right now. What's going on? All right. All right, let's see what else here. What else here? What's going on with my Capricorns? going on here all right so yeah okay so it all right you could be dealing with another capricorn here aries aquarius Yeah, so what I see here, um, Capricorns, is that it's like you had, you know, at one point you had real deep, you know, emotions for this person. It's like you had a lot of love for this person, okay? It's like at one point, it's like you chose them here and it's like you really seen yourself here, you know, with them, okay? But right now, it's like since this person here is like not ready you know it's like they're constantly you know uh, uh it's like they're going back and forth here like this person is kind of like going back and forth with you possibly like playing little mind games here just kind of keeping you stuck here um and wondering here that's what i kind of see here and it's like here it's it's like i see you left them that's what i see you know, this person could have been in like a dark space here. Um, you could have felt like this person was like in a really dark space. But yeah, with this devil in reverse, I definitely see you left this person because you offered your love to them. Um, they were not ready. They didn't see like your worth here. Yeah, I see you left them. Yeah, you left them right on behind here. All right. Yeah, so... Yeah, you left them. It's like, it looks like this person, um, it, 
Yeah. It's like you basically, it's like they didn't see your worth here. That's what I see. It's like they didn't see your worth. Um, they were basically like taking like their sweet old time, you know, um, you know, uh, playing mind games here to kind of keep you around, but really was not ready here. Um, they were not really prepared for a connection here or prepared for true love or didn't see it. So you showed them your absence. That's what I see here. Full reverse. You showed them your absence here. Okay. And it's like now here, uh, with the seven of swords in the reverse, it's like now they want to come back and make amends here. It's like now that you've actually showed them your absence here. Yeah. Okay. But it's like, you're not going for that shit. It's like, you're not going for that shit. It's like, you're, you're doing a total 360. You're doing a total life change. You're focusing on yourself here. Um, a total lifestyle change here. That's what I kind of see here. Um, you know, that, that you, that you either that you're doing or you decided to do here. Okay. Like you are incorporating different things, like in your routine, you starting to like focus on yourself. That's what I kind of see that you, that you've done here, Capricorn. Okay. Like you could have incorporated some more hobbies or something of that sort. Um, you know, more things, uh, you know, things that you enjoy, you know, more self care here. That's what I, that's what I seen. Yeah. Yeah, I see you just you just basically hopped your, on your horse here and it's like you you moved right on forward here. And it's like you just basically just left this person behind. It's like you know, you you're not going to basically deal with someone who's just not ready or who's not going to see your worth here. That's what I see here. All right, let's see. Let's see what else here. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, this person was like, yeah, like I said, like this person was not ready. They didn't see your worth. Um, it's like, yes, this person was like very toxic. It's like this was a toxic person. This was somebody who wanted not only like to keep you stuck here, like for their own benefits while they were not ready, Capricorn, like they were not ready. But it's like they wanted to like find a way to keep you around. That's what I see. So this person, what it kind of seems like here, um, was like this person here, King of Wands in reverse, like this person was trying to like break you. That's what I seen to make them feel better about themselves. That's what I kind of see, um, or to, to bring you down to their level or so that they could feel better about themselves. That's what I kind of see kind of like a bully almost, but you know, uh, yeah, bullies, like, this is, like, somebody who bullies, like, someone who bullies someone to, like, make themselves, uh, feel better, so I'm having a feeling, like, this is someone who's very insecure, yeah, yeah, so it's, like, they, what I see here is, I like, guess, this person was manipulating you, like, they were emotionally manipulating you here, um, possibly, like, to break you, you know, uh, because maybe they felt like that's the only way that they can keep you around or that they feel worthy of. Yeah, that's that's someone like you were dealing with someone who was really insecure, Capricorn, unfortunately. OK. Um, or didn't have any self-worth uh, themselves. OK, so it's like they tried to like bring you down to where they were at. You know, to maybe feel more worthy to maybe even offer a cup to you back. Yeah, because this person didn't feel worthy or felt like that they, um, or felt like they deserved you. So if they brought you down or, or tried to break you, like they may, they may, that may get, they may make them feel better about themselves or get you to stay, you know, if they were to break you down. But yeah, I don't, I don't see that that broke you down at all. I see that you hopped on your horse and you went along your merry way. That's what I see. That's what I see, Capricorn. Okay, let's see what else is going on here. What else is going on? What else is going on with this person here? Yeah, so it's like this person knew. 
Yeah, it's like this person knew that you made them happy. It's like this person knew that you were the one and you probably brought them more happiness than anybody. You know what I'm saying? It's like they seen happiness with you, but for some reason they still didn't feel worthy of because they were trying to like, because they were trying to, um, they were trying to break you down here. <clears throat> yes. It's like this person, it's like they knew that you were able to give them everything that they were looking for. That's what I'm seeing here. It's like, um, this person could have manifested you in their lives, not you personally, but, um, someone like you. Okay. But it's like, when you came around, it's like, they didn't feel worthy of, but it's like, they knew that you would be able to provide them with everything that they were looking for, that they have been wishing for. Yeah. And then it looks like they just ran you away. Like literally they ran you away. You in the horse because you hopped on your horse and you was gone. Yeah. All right. Let's see what else here. Could be dealing with um, a Sagittarius. Like I said, I think I said Aries and Aquarius already. Um, Gemini or another uh capricorn what else here is going on with this person oh yeah so it's like this person wanted you to yeah, it's like this person here, it's like they were stalling, you know, like I said. It's like they were stalling the connection here because they were not ready. King of Wands in reverse, Seven of Wands in reverse. It's like this person was stalling because they thought that you were always going to stay around. That That's what I see here. And I see that's that's something that they're still doing here, so... What I kind of see is like this person looked like that they could have crossed many boundaries. It looked like they, they probably tried to test you like many times, you know, to kind of see how far that that they can uh, uh, push Capricorn or to see like how much they can get away with Capricorn. And all they did was really just run you away. That's what I see. It's like this person didn't really have strong boundaries themselves. That's what I kind of see. So it's like they ran into you and it's like they seen, you know, that, you know, they seen like this strong being here. Like they seen like this strong being, being and it's like they tried to like break down your boundaries. They just tried to break you down, period. Emotionally, just all around the border here. Because this person was insecure. It's like they were insecure about their weaknesses, about their own weaknesses. That's something that this person just ponders upon all the time. That's what I see here. Let me get one more card here. Ooh. Yeah, I said one more card though. <laughs> Every time I say one more card, the energy just slaps a whole bunch of cards out my hand. <laughs> Every time. And look, and it's still, it's still. <laughs> yeah, it's like this person always wanted to start fights with you. It's like this person is like in competition with you or like always want to be like at war with you. Yeah, like this person was literally trying to like get you out your character. Like that's what I see. It's like all around the border, they were just trying to... It's like they wanted to see you fall. It's like they wanted to see you fall. They wanted to break you down. It's like they seen that you were full of love and you were ready. That's what they seen. Uh, seen. It's like, and they just wanted to take advantage of that. And they knew how you felt. You knew, you. they knew how you felt. Like, <laughs> that's what I see here. And they thought that you would never leave. Yeah. 
yeah so yeah seven of cups so yeah this person was definitely keeping you as an option you know um definitely keeping you as an option Yeah, this person knew, yeah, it's like they knew that they were not ready to commit. They knew that they had other options or dealing with other people here. And they just decided to just string you along and to try to like keep you stuck, you know, possibly from, you know, the things that you were doing. That's what I kind of see Capricorn, whatever was going on with you. Um, it's like they didn't want to see, it's like they didn't want to see you do good because maybe possibly they were in a bad um like a bad uh, space themselves, like a dark space here. Yeah. Yeah. Is this, that's all I see. I see that they had you waiting. It's like they were delayed. They delayed, they were delaying shit like on purpose. It's like they knew your feelings. They was delaying the connection on purpose. It's like even though they, they knew 